We're going to make a program that solves for the gravity force between two masses. This requires three variables, mass 1, mass 2, and a distance the two masses are apart. To start, press the program button and go to New. Enter. Then ask for a title. I'm going to call it F-Grav for force of gravity. But you can't use spaces in the title of the programs. Now press Enter. Now the first command we want to use is called the input command, and you find all your commands in the program button, I-O for input, output, input. I want, in, I want the input command. How input works is it first asks for display text. I'm going to put mass 1 here first. And then it asks for a variable to store as mass1. I'm going to put in mass1 as being a. Next, same thing, but for mass2. So input, output, input. Go into alpha lock, quote first, and then mass2. Comma, and then variable b. Finally, um, we want a distance, so program, I-O, input, so I want distance. Alpha lock, quote, distance, question mark, I'm going to put a space there, it looks nice for the user, unquote. Notice you can use the second alpha to lock your mode into alpha in the alphabet mode so you can keep typing things. Comma, alpha, C. Let's test this out. Let's leave the program. Second quit. Program. I'm going to run it now. Execute. Gravity. Now I see, okay, displays mass 1. I'll put a number in. 8. Mass 2. 88. And distance 2. What that's done is it's now stored A as 8, B as 88, and C as my 2. Let's go back and edit the program tomorrow. So program, edit, force of gravity. Now I want to help have the calculators calculate the gravity force. So I'm going to do this equation in the calculator. I'm going to put a bracket first. For, and g is 6.67 with a negative exponent of 11. Then times by mass 1, which is a, times by mass 2, which is b, divided by distance, c, squared. So my equation has a squared there. On bracket, I'm going to then going to store this number as another variable. Store. I'm going to store it as g, just for fun. Enter. Now I want to display, I'm going to set 4 here, display the answer to the user. So I'm going to say program, input, output, display, and display works as you can display multiple text by using quotes. So I can say, let's say, display quote, the answer, or maybe even the force. <coughs> the force of gravity, or this is the force, is unquote, then display the answer, which is G comma, alpha, g, and I'll even include units, alpha lock again, um, oops, I missed alpha lock, alpha lock, quote, newtons. Unquote. This now displays the force is the variable g, which is the answer, newtons. Let's test it out. I can quit, program, Execute force of gravity, enter. Let's get mass one is some kind of large planet, maybe. Five exponent twenty-eight. Mass two is a person, eighty kilograms, and they're an appreciable distance apart, say about five million. This then stores variables in A, B, and C, does it does the math, and it gives you the answer. This many newtons. Okay, hope that worked for you. Good luck.